David Zeritsky for the Bond Experience. Welcome back. Okay, that is just a, a small taste of what you're about to experience. We are here. It is actually the very first day that we've landed. And the very first stop is kind of hallowed ground. Now today, just quickly, you know how we do this. I'm wearing an NPL top, but of course I had to wear an Omega watch because we're here at the Omega Museum. This place is incredible. Now here's the deal. This is not going to be a long video that tells you every little piece about this museum. I want to give you a taste. Call it an appetizer because the whole point is you've got to get here to Beale, Switzerland and see this place for yourself. So without further ado, wait for it. And by the way, I know what you're here for. You're going to wonder where's all the James Bond stuff. Trust me, it's the, uh, it's the crescendo at the end. Wait for it.
You are not seeing things. If you look over there, it almost looks like a drive-through, like a, a fast food place, because this is a drive-through. It's the only Swatch watch drive-through in the entire world. It's supposed to represent the, the whimsical aspect of Swatches. You simply drive up, buy your watch, and you go. I, I'm wondering if they have the moon watch here. Let's check it out. Okay, that last part at the end was thrown in as a bit of a surprise. Yes, we were taken on a private and rather exclusive tour of the manufacturing, different phases that they go through. It was not only intricate and complex and process oriented, there was a side effect that we found out as we were watching people put these parts of the watches together. It told a story and we've talked about the brand Omega being storytellers in their own right. But we saw the individuals, we saw the people, the craftsmen, the old world craftsmanship meeting technology, and it kept telling a story. But the thing that we couldn't foresee that we saw in droves is that Omega is much more than a company. It's much more than a luxury brand. It's a family of people. We actually witnessed, this is not something that was planned, we witnessed a woman that worked here for 35 years retire. The clapping, the emotion, the connection, it showed to myself and Danielle that what we wear on our wrists is a product of people, of individuals and family. A long history, luxury, James Bond, absolutely. But there's more than meets the eye. Yeah, these watches, they, they have a certain gravitas to them right now. Listen, we're gonna show you some images. We couldn't show you everything because shh, some of it's top secret, but we'll take you through some images of what we've been here. In the meantime, if you can get here, the reason we kept this short is you need to get here if you can and see the museum. By the way, the swatch floor alone was absolutely amazing. In the meantime, we're gonna explore the rest of Switzerland. And this has been David Zeritsky for the Bond Experience. We'll see you all real soon. Take care.
Thanks for watching this episode. If you want to be up on the latest from the Bond experience, just click on this subscribe and subscribe to our channel. You're going to get all the latest and greatest information plus some exclusive content. And by the way, speaking of content, here's something especially for you just because we know you. Talk to you soon.